all right guys this is my last haul sorry you guys are at a weird angle i can't find my um camera holder so i've just got you propped up but this is my last haul it's hobby lobby joann's and I think a couple of things from Michael's. I'm not 100% sure, but I know definitely Hobby Lobby and Joann's. I'm going to start with the really big stuff. Oh, so I got this at Hobby Lobby. Pull it back here. And it's like a little shutter. And this is solid. This was originally $19.99. And it was 66% off. So I think I paid five or six bucks for it and it's I mean it's big as you can you can see it's decent I'm obviously going to redo it even though I like the home sweet home I don't want the red white and blue so I'm gonna change that up and I already have a couple of ideas we'll see but that'll be soon because I want to be able to use it outside soon here so that's that these were from Hobby Lobby as well, and these were, these are pretty decent size. They do have like the little ridge in there. They were um, originally $17.99 each. They they said $1.70, and when I went up there, I think they rung up at like 80 something cents. So I did get two of them, and I have an idea if I can get these things off without messing it up too much um hopefully i can uh i can just leave it like that that's fine just leave it like that um hopefully i can get these things off and it'll work out the way that i'm planning so i did get two of those and uh, sorry guys this stuff is pretty big i got this one I don't like the picture, and you know I don't like the pink. Sorry, you know I don't like the pink. You know that, and I don't like the flowers, but I like the look of it. This was originally $19.99, and it was down to a dollar. Let's see. You can see that. And I don't know. This was on there. Somebody must have touched it with greasy fingers at the store. I don't know, but it was a dollar got this which I love probably my favorite piece that I got this will stay exactly the way that it is it's in great condition there's no scrapes no dings no nothing it was originally $21.99 it says it's $210 I think it rang up at like 90 cents if I'm not mistaken I don't have my receipt with me but I think it rang up 90 cents then, is this Hobby Lobby? Yeah, this Hobby Lobby. This was regular. Oh no, it folded. This was a stencil. Oh no, it wasn't regular price. It was 74, oops, 74 cents. It says farmhouse. It folded. I oh, hope I can get that out. Um, and it was originally $2.99. It says 74. I think it rang up at like 34 or 30 cents or something like that. And then, what's this? Oh, this was in the 4th of July, just like the shutter, it was 4th of July stuff. Um, this was $3.99 and 66% off, so I think it was like a dollar and some change. Um, but I liked it. I should have gotten a couple more, but I only got the one. So I'm going to do something with those, with that one. Then I got... A couple bags of little wooden pieces. These are big uh, beads. Sorry, I lost my <laughs> train of thought there. These big beads, they were originally $1.99. It says $0.99, cents, and I think they rang up at like $0.30, $0.40, cents, something like that. And these are little miniature drawer pools. They were original. They were they were originally $2.49. It says $0.62, cents, um, but I think they rang up at like $0.30 something cents. And um, there's, I don't know how many, maybe 10, I think it says. It's covered up by the sticker, but there are 10 of them in there. So that's that. Then these I thought were amazing. 
and a great, great find. And I'm glad that I was able to find the letters that I did. So they had these cute wood looking like bark or wood branches, but they're like ceramic, I, I guess. Originally $6.99, they were reduced to $0.69. Cents. And I think these might have rung up at $0.69. Cents. I don't think there was a bigger discount. But they only had like random letters. But I was able to find J-O-Y. Oops, J-O and Y. So I think this is going to be a cute DIY for like Christmas. So I got that. And those. And I think those rang up as... Uh, whatever it says on there and then that's it for this bag except for this i found these cute little um like keyhole plaques or whatever they're called plates and they were originally 4.99 and it says 124 but i think they rang up at like 90 something cents so that was it for that one and this Wait, hold on. Oh, here's the other stuff. I know I had something else from there. So this is, these were originally $5.99 and they rang up at $0.59. Cents. I don't, I'm not going to use it like it is. I'm going to redo it. Don't know what I'm going to put on it yet, but I am going to do something to it. This was, um... It's a metal, gold metal hello sign, and it was originally $8.99, and it was $0.49. Cents. So, I thought that was cute, and I'll probably spray paint it, because I don't really do a whole lot of gold, but I'll probably do it maybe black, or, I don't know, some other color, to do something with that, or give it to one of my girls, maybe, I'm not really sure. Then, I got this, um little wood pile basket it was $4.49 and I had a coupon I think this was the only thing that was like regular price and I had a 40% coupon and like a 20% off my whole purchase coupon or something like that so I don't know what I paid for this but I thought it was cute and I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet but it was cute oh sorry then let's see what else oh this was cute and oops it's got to be tightened up but look at this cute little globe and it turns but it's got to be i got to take this little plate off and re-screw it in there um originally 7.99 and it was 79 cents and this is all still hobby lobby right now and i got these little latches um, they were two ninety two twenty nine, and I had I used a coupon for those because they were they weren't on sale, as well as these. These were three ninety nine, and again I think I got, I had like a forty percent off or twenty percent off your total purchase or something like that, but I didn't pay full price for any of this stuff. And then I got some Sherbonder fabric um, hot glue sticks. They were two ninety nine. I think this is the only thing that I paid full price from Hobby Lobby um then I think the last things that I got were from Joanne and they were some more cute happy planner stuff now sorry for being further down like that um wait I think I already showed I showed you this already and I think I showed you guys this I'm not sure but I got this at um, Joanne. I just thought it was cute. And it was $2.47 and then it was 30% off of that. So that's why I got that. So then I just went to Hobby Lobby this past weekend. Like I told you, my husband took me. And I got the Happy Planner 9 Hole Punch. Now I did just get the other one. The smaller one, which isn't really working as well as I had planned for it to work it does work for my smaller ones but it doesn't work very well for my bigger planners so I got that one and it was 50% off of whatever the, I think so it was like 10 bucks after all was said and done um and then 
I got these cute little stickers. They were from, these are Joann's. They rang up at like 47 cents. It says 97, but they were like 40 something cents. Then I got these two, um, I got this little pack of stickers. And I think they were a dollar and eight cents. And then these two, uh, these went together and this went together. So these bags came together in a pack. And I think this is probably what I paid the most for. And it was only $2.98. So you get these two bags. And this one's pretty big. You know, I like the size of that one. And they're like insulated kind of. So I like those. And then I got this week's activities and this was a dollar maybe 38 I think it was it was very every nothing was over three dollars that I got from there um so these came together and then these came together so I got those and those like I said were three dollars now these oops this is um just a notebook and it says planners got a plan and it's just got paper in there and I just liked the dividers and stuff a dollar thirty eight a dollar thirty eight so and then I got this one I think this is another notebook oh this is a uh, a journal a fitness journal a wellness journal fitness journal wellness journal which I thought was great because I just got those other stickers from Dollar Tree. And that's going to work great with these. So this one, it says healthy looks different on every body. And then it's got these cute, <clears throat> excuse me, dividers. Oh, it's got that cute little inside. These dividers. And then the pages on the inside say goals this week, meal prep ideas, Three ways you can nourish your body this week and what is motivating, excuse me, what is motivating you this week. And then as you open it, it has other little entries that you can put in there. So like I said, I'm trying to get on this healthy journey. Um, just because, you know, after I had my son, I just kind of, I don't know, I think I just got tired, overwhelmed. I had some health issues. So it was hard for me to lose that weight. So it's time to get in gear and do what I have to do. So yeah. Then I got this one. Um, it is, it's just paper. I'm trying to see if there's like a brand, but it's the wrong wrong. And it just has one, two, three, four little sections on it. And you know, you could, it's the biggest one. This is the 11 ring one. So it goes in like the biggest notebooks that you can get which I have two of and I love them. And then I got this desktop planner and um, it goes from July of this year to June of next year. And those are the months. And it comes with a few stickers. Let me see. It comes with those stickers. So that's for our desks. And then I think that's it. That was it. That's what I got. Like I said, it was a crazy haul. Um, but... I blame it on my husband. So <laughs> that's it, guys. So you're going to see some of this stuff coming up in DIYs. Um, I'm going to probably do another happy planner video. I'm not uh, like any kind of happy planner uh, squad member or anything like that. I like planners. And I just so happened to hit the jackpot this go around with happy planner. Um, but let me know in the comments if you wouldn't, if you would like for me to do, I think they call it, um, Franken planners. I believe that's what it's called. Cause I like to take my planners apart and like use the pieces from the planners that I like and put them together. So I think that's what they call it. Franken planners. Now I am not a, I don't, you know, decorate every week, every month or anything like that, but I just like to put them together. That's that's what I like to do. So I'm putting one together for my friend's daughter right now as kind of like a student planner. So if you guys want to see that, let me know and I'll start recording kind of how I've been doing it, what I'm going to do to make it work, because I'm probably going to use an old planner spread that I have and make it into the 2021 
planner. So just let me know if it's something you'd be interested in doing and I'll I'll record myself and I've got quite a few DIYs coming up so I've been busy. I've been recording like crazy. So that's why I was like, you know what? I'm going to sit down and do this video, these videos today or they're just not going to get done and I wanted to show you guys stuff that they have now in case you, you know, you see something you like, you can go check it out. Um and that's it guys that is it so that is it for my haul videos the only thing that I have left is a thrift store haul it's a big one and it's been stuff that I've been collecting for months and I just haven't been able to do a video on them and um so I think I'm going to try recording that tonight it's my son's birthday so we're going to do a little dinner but um after that, I mean, he goes to bed. So, um, so I think I'm going to try recording that today and putting that out. Maybe this, this week will be a week of haul videos just because they're recorded already. And, um, I have enough of them, I think to go from Monday to Friday. So we'll see. And, um, there will be other videos posting. I have a couple of good collaborations coming up. So definitely check those out. And I think that's it. So until the next time, guys, be the reason someone smiles. Bye. Okay, guys, so I have to add one more thing from Hobby Lobby. I forgot that it was sitting on the floor. Oh, this is such a great find. So I found clock letters or no <laughs> clock letters, clock numbers. You know, I found one. And I'm like, oh man, you know, do they have other ones? They just had it sitting, they just had it sitting in the clearance clearance section. So I was like, oh man, that you know. So I grabbed it anyway, and it was the number four. Obviously, not this one. Um, but it was the number four, and I was like, well, I, or the number three. And I was like, oh well, I could use it for something, you know. It would be oh, here it is. This is the piece that I had that I found. And I was like, oh well, I can use it for something. It was like 10 cents. And then it rung up at like three cents for this one piece. So I took this up there and then I grabbed this. I put it in my cart. And as I was walking out of the aisle, I found, I saw that, you know, I saw a little piece sticking out of a corner and I'm like, oh man, it's, what's that? And I looked and it was the whole clock set. The only thing that it's missing is the arms or the little, you know, the arms for the clock. But it had all the numbers. It had all the numbers. And they're a decent size. So I got this. It said it was $13.99. I got up there. It was $1.40. $1.40. So that's my other find. Sorry for the noise in the background. And that's it, guys.